I'm going to show you how to parent connect your PowerBeats Pro directly to your Sony TV via Bluetooth. Okay, this is the Sony TV that has Google TV. First thing is go to the settings on your Sony TV. Some of you guys may have a settings button on your remote. It's like a gear, it's a gear picture icon. If not, we're going to go on the screen here. Just click on the home screen on your remote and go all the way up and then move all the way over to the right to the photo avatar right there. And we're going to go down one to settings right there. Click on OK on the remote. From here, we're going to go all the way down to remotes and accessories right down here. Remotes and accessories. Click on OK. Now, make sure the Bluetooth is turned on, okay? So first thing we're gonna do from here is we're gonna go ahead and put this in pairing mode. As soon as we put this in pairing mode, then we're gonna go down here and click on pair accessory, okay? So let's put this in pairing mode first. Let me go ahead and open this up. And you know it's in pairing mode when it has a white blinking light, okay? You can see right there. If you can't, I mean, there's a, uh, a button too, if you have like a solid light or anything like that, you have a button here, just press and hold it for like five seconds until it starts blinking white. If you can't get it to blink white to put it in pairing mode, then you can simply just go ahead and reset these. Just look in the link below and I'll show you how to reset these, okay? Anyway, it's in pairing mode, it's blinking white. We're gonna go down to accessory on the TV. We're gonna go down, just one, right? Pair accessory and then click on okay. It's still in pairing mode and now it's searching let me see if it finds it. Okay, there we go. Power Beats Pro. Now, if it takes more than 15 seconds, click on the back button in your remote and do it over again. Okay, anyway, I see Power Beats Pro right there. Let me go down, click on OK. And it says pairing right now. We still get a white blinking light. Now I get a pairing request here, and it's highlighted on pair right there already. I'm going to click on pair. And let's wait for it to be paired. And you can see switch audio to PowerBeats Pro. And you can see the light here is now solid, indicating that we are connected now. And you can see the PowerBeats Pro right down here. Okay, so now I can go ahead and put these on and I can watch Netflix or YouTube or whatnot. Okay, good luck, guys.